Hello everyone. I am Dr. Anil Kamat. I am a senior consultant surgical oncologist here at Helios Cancer Clinic. So what is oncoplastic breast surgery? So let me update you about this particular procedure. So this is a procedure done for breast cancer. We have the full spectrum of surgeries for breast cancer. Certain number of patients have to undergo full removal of the breast, what we call as mastectomy. From mastectomy, we have evolved to breast conservation surgery where it is not thought to be necessary to remove the full breast. In certain particular types of breast cancers, you can preserve the breast. But what happens in breast conservation surgery is that sometimes you have to remove a large volume of the breast. So even though you preserve the breast, the shape of the breast is distorted and cosmetically it is not satisfactory. The other problem is that most of the time we put the incision directly over the tumour which can lead to a bad scar. The third problem of breast conservation surgery is that there is loss of breast tissue and usually it is filled by fluid we call as seroma. While seroma gives some amount of shape to the breast, it may sometimes get lost when during follow-up or when radiation is given leading to distortion of the breast when the radiation is completed. So these problems of breast conservation surgery are addressed by a procedure known as oncoplastic breast surgery. It is a, as the name suggests, it's a combination of oncology and plastic surgery. We have various plastic surgical procedures on the breast which are not related to oncology like sometimes reduction of the breast or augmentation of the breast and certain other procedures. The principles of these surgery are applied to the patient who has cancer of the breast so that one, we can provide an oncologically safe surgery for the breast tumour and second, we can improve the cosmesis also. When these two are combined, the procedure is called a oncoplastic breast surgery. So like I said earlier, while in breast conservation surgery, we put the incision directly on the tumour, in oncoplastic uh, breast surgery, it might be a hidden incision somewhere beneath the breast or somewhere in the uh, areolar region and such things. So this may mean approaching tumour which is far away from the scar. And once the tumour is removed, certain plastic surgery procedures are done to fill the tissue with either fat or local tissue so that the shape of the breast is maintained. Now apart from this, sir, in certain conditions, the size of the breast may also have to be reduced to match the other size, what we call as reduction mammoplasty or sometimes enhanced also what you call as augmentation mammoplasty. So the aim of all these procedures is not just to save the breast but also to give a good cosmetic appearance to the breast. Now which patients need orthoplastic breast reconstruction? Any patient in whom the breast conservation surgery is advised is also a candidate for oncoplastic breast surgery. But if it is a small tumour, the volume of the breast lost is very less, say it only 10 to 20 percent, then there may not be a huge difference between the regular breast conservation surgery and the oncoplastic breast surgery. So the amount of cosmetic benefit to be gained may be lesser. But if the volume of loss of the breast is high, say 30-40% or even more, then certainly oncoplastic breast surgery will help improve the cosmosis. When the defect is much larger, the tissue may not come from the breast itself. We may have to use tissue from nearby, like local flaps or flap from the back, what we call as latissimus dorsi flap. And the, the term oncoplastic surgery is also used when full removal of the breast is done and reconstruction is desired, so the tissue is obtained from elsewhere like the abdomen or from the back. In oncoplastic reconstruction, there may be uh, this one to either preserve the nipple areolar region or to reconstruct it.
So these are the various principles of oncoplastic breast surgery. Like I said, you can discuss with your surgeon about the need for oncoplastic breast surgery, especially if you are very much aware about the cosmetic implication of breast cancer surgery. Thank you.